What? What's up, Divas and Divos? You already know what time it is, and you definitely already know who it is. So let's get this wig video popping. This is for NewYorkHairMall.com, and I've already mentioned them in a prior video, but if you're not aware of them and who they are, we have worked together for many years. So this time around, we're going to do this totally different video. Like, when I say it's different, it's like... Girl, what was you thinking? But listen, I'm all up for trying a new thing. And what may be good for you may not be good for me. And what may be good for me definitely may not be good for you. So I just try to do something for everybody. If you don't like it, then that's fine. If you love it, then that's even better. So with that being said, this one right here is by the Zuri brand, which is their Sis Sister Wig Company or their Sis Sister Wig Collection. And it is called the Wavy Faux Locks. Okay. Well, it's called Lock Lace Wella. And the color I have is a 1B. I decided to do this one in a natural color just because it's locks. Now, first of all, it's faux locks. Faux locks, man. You know, I'm out to do some something different, something totally different. So, yes. Now, the one thing that I would rather prefer, it would be longer, but it ain't. And now I'm going to just go back to my regular accent because I don't really think I'm doing it justice, but, you know, it's all for fun. So, I'm definitely not disrespecting anybody or poking fun at anybody, but I just figured we'd have fun with this. So, the cap is constructed really Really good it has the combs right here and does have a pre-tweeze part so you best believe I already got my concealer out and it does have combs on the side an adjustable strap and a nape in the back area now, like I said it is short um, I would really rather have preferred it to be longer and yeah that's just basically it so the first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and use some of this concealer that I always use because I'm trying my best to let it look natural as possible so the parting in it is really, really good, meaning it's nice and wide. It's wide enough to make it look like a natural scalp. So the first thing that I'm going to have to definitely do is either push this um, wig grip thing back a little bit because it's kind of probably kind of like hinder the whole thing of me putting apart. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use my concealer a little bit more. And I'm going to go ahead and use my hair gel, which is the Gorilla Snot Gel. for me totally different but I did hook it up the best of my abilities especially because these are kind of hard to unravel normally when I do like the braid wigs I unbraid them or I untwist them and I lock them into my own hair but with this being locked I don't really think that's possible but it does look cute. It reminds, you know what? I feel like I'm, I feel like my mother right now. Like, she, cause she wears her hair like this all the time. She has been wearing her hair like this for probably like 25 years. And it's like the same length and she just loves it. And it looks cute on her. But when I look at this, I think 
of my mother. I honestly do. And not in a bad way, but I just really think like, you know what, maybe when I get older, um, a little bit older, <laughs> or maybe a lot older, this will be the style for me. I don't it know. is a cute style, especially for those who want to try locks out and you don't want to hassle. It takes a minute to grow your hair out like that. So, yep. I do have like the fake locks that I want to entwine in my hair, but I haven't gotten around to it and I have to watch some video tutorials too. But it is a good quality wig. Um, it is a little itchy to me. So if you take like a little bit of your hair out in the front and you can basically wrap it into the front perimeter. You don't have to go ahead and unwrap the twist, but just remove like some a tiny bit of your front perimeter, kind of like gel it and wrap it into the twist and it will look a lot more natural. But the parting is great. In the front here, I just kind of like hiked my hair out a little bit so it wouldn't look so flat and perfect because it is locked. And yeah, that's basically about it. I love to see when these wig companies come out all different type of styles and you just be like wow wigs have evolved a long way so definitely check out my peoples at newyorkhairmall.com so on that note i love you guys i hope you enjoyed this tutorial the color that i'm rocking is a 1b and i'll post all the information for you guys below i love you make sure you thumbs it up because you love me just as much and i will see y'all in a soon to come video